Dear friends, I am Dr. J. S. Katpal. I am working for the Department of Neurology at Choitram Hospital and Research Center. And you'll be glad to know that I am working almost since inception of the hospital. That is, I'm working since March of 1980, when the hospital was very recently opened in the city of Indore. Today again is that our for we people it's an auspicious day that it's an annual day of Chaitra Hospital and Research Center, and it has been really, really very heartening to see that every year the institution has been making a progress, and that is what was and that is what was desirable, not only desirable for us, desirable for the desirable for the staff desirable for the management of this institution and desirable for the city of indore and the state of madhya pradesh if i tell you briefly that we joined here after getting trained in neurology the problem was that there was not any center in the entire madhya pradesh where everything was available under one ceiling where entire neurology that means neurosciences could be practiced which includes at least uh, the neurology the neurosurgery the neurophysiology psychiatry and its allied things so for when this hospital came up and they had infrastructure including everything of our, not only of our department but also of several other departments and several several other departments were also working independently today we cannot treat a patient as one that okay you go to neurology and you get the entire treatment you never know the patient may have related systemic illness and the patient may require treatment for that so a specialist has to be available under one roof for the same so that the patient doesn't have to go here and there that was the whole idea and philosophy i suppose for opening this institution because before this i remember it very distinctly that people had to go for small and big things to cities like bombay or delhi or these places to get their further treatment done for example neurosurgical services were not available in our city so we had the first neurosurgeon in 1981 and we continued even with good good neurosurgery facilities in this hospital and then gradually as you know the transplant scan the kidney transplant scan which were being done in a big way and today we are done in more than 1000 today we can boast of having all the departments under one roof which is which is a very important thing in running an institution nicely we didn't have neuro imaging because there was no no neuro imaging in and almost in the entire country at that time but the choitram hospital and research center kept everything with time we kept everything with time and things like ct scan mri scan angiographies cardiac surgery gastrointestinal surgeries uro surgeries very good obstetric and gynec surgeries they all came one after the other and we kept on enjoying the full work here the other point which i would like to note that from the first day only it was very impressive that this was though not believed by people but gradually they started believing because seeing is believing so they had seen that how cheap the facilities were the opd remained free, free for years years together the entire opd in which all the specialists of all the departments were seeing patients without any cost to the patient the general ward was subsidized thereby helping the low socio economic group of the public 
and we were getting patients not only from the suburbans of Indore but also from suburbans of Maharashtra, Gujarat, Rajasthan, etc. We are doing academic activities side by side at the same time. Today we have Diplomat National Board facilities for many departments. The Neurology Department started the super specialty training almost first in this hospital. And we are so, we are so proud of it. And the facilities are still going on and our candidates are getting trained and they are becoming neurologists in all the parts of the country. There is a lot more to say, but I suppose at this moment, I would just wish everybody good luck and I hope the hospital will continue to do its services for people of every walk of life. Whether it is a poor patient, whether it is a middle class patient, whether it is a high class patient. So I think I would like to stop at this. Thank you very much. The management is very cooperating in running the hospital and in helping out each department looking at their demands and giving them facilities without bothering whether there will be a monetary return for this particular event or not. So that's a great thing to happen and let's hope that it will do not only good in the central part of India but people will come here for treatment from the rest of the country also. Thank you very much.